No, your eyes aren't fooling you, that is in fact an AK-47 underfolding stock on an AR-15. This is my own original design. I invented this in my garage a couple weeks ago, and I thought it was just too cool not to share. So it uses all genuine Milser parts, and it basically just mounts on the buffer tube and allows you to just chuck one on there. And it does work on a um, standard carbine buffer tube. It worked just fine on a, a pistol buffer tube or one of those compact 300 blackout or 9mm or 45 buffer tubes. And it does work with a 22 pistol plug, which is what I have on there right now, which you may be wondering. Uh, I, cur I have a um, CMMG 22 drop-in bolt kit in there that lets me run 22s. That's why these magazines look funky and why the bolt looks like that. So yeah, I just chucked this in my, um, in my AR upper. This isn't my dedicated 22, which I built this stock for, just to make it look as ugly as possible. And I think I achieved that. So, I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but I definitely want to show it off, because I think it will uh, turn a lot of heads. Now let's do a little shooting with the thing, just to prove that it does in fact work. Alright, just to show you that this is an airsoft, this is an actual AR-15. I'm going to throw some lead at a little spinner down there. Once again, this is a 22, so don't be disappointed when it just makes a little thwack. Uh, first, we're going to do it with the uh, stock extended. And with the stock closed, oh yeah, fresh mag, it does close over a full AR magazine, and it doesn't contact the handguard, but it does bump on the bolt release, and it's a little hard to get to the safety. Once again, this only works on a on pistol calibers. I haven't ex I haven't tested it on a 5.56 or 2.23. It may work just fine, but it does change the the axis of recoil, so it may put a little too much strain on a buffer tube for it to be safe to shoot. But it shouldn't explode. It should just break your buffer tube or maybe your lower. Yeah, so that's it. It's not available for sale or anything at the moment. Uh, I don't have the resources to get a manufacturing company up and running, but I might sell them, might not, who knows.